How we doing? Meteorologist Steve Fandero here hanging in the Weather Center. Uh, things changing pretty quickly. The radar is going to become busy. Uh, we got some downpours and thunderstorms out towards the west. Hopefully you enjoyed the sunshine today because those clouds definitely thickened up pretty quickly. There's uh, some solid strong storms down towards the, uh, the south and west of us, closer to central North Carolina. A couple warnings with those as well. Some severe thunderstorm warnings, a lot of lightning down there. We're going to watch the threat for some of these stronger storms and downpours to slide into northeastern North Carolina over the next couple of hours. For the Hampton Roads area, it looks like we'll just get a brief bout of some downpours over the next couple of hours. There have been a few little showers popping up along the peninsula, so just something to mine as the clouds thickening up maybe getting a little bit ominous through six seven eight o'clock that's kind of our window for our evening precipitation today we're going to dry out later tonight with some clouds around temperatures only in the upper 50s that warm front lifting through the region warm fronts are just i gotta be honest they're pretty lame uh this morning we were post cold front that's why it was so beautiful this afternoon, currently, we're dealing with a warm front, and that's why we have some thunderstorms on the radar to talk about. So this is going to lift into the region uh, through the rest of our evening and to tonight. Then by Sunday, it sets in a warm air mass, very warm, very humid, very windy for Sunday, and it's going to spark up some more thunderstorms, uh, a greater risk for some severe thunderstorms on Sunday. We have a, an enhanced risk for severe weather, so pretty much level 3 out of 5, and that puts us with damaging wind as the main concern with these scattered thunderstorms, whereas an isolated tornado or two can't be ruled out. So Sunday is the day to stay weather aware, but do not forget the downpours out there this evening. So what started as a very beautiful, pleasant weekend is turning a little bit on the stormier side. We'll keep you guys posted through the rest of the evening. We'll have all the details tonight on Weave News 10 at 6 as well.